So here we have HTC Fly, it's our new tablet, uh, running uh, Android uh, Gingerbread. We have a 7 inch screen with a 1024 by 600 um, display. You can see on the front, we've got a front facing camera here, some uh, soft keys down the bottom. If I flip it around, you'll see we've got a 5 megapixel camera on the back and you'll see our uh, uni unibody aluminium design. Inside we have a 1.5 gigahertz processor with 1 gig of RAM um, and we also have 32 gig of um, storage available which you can expand using a uh, micro SD card. Now I'm going to show you some of the tweaks we've made to HTC Sense for tablet. So if I just move it like this you can see that the widgets start to animate themselves in 3D. Slide across, within the music you can see it just moves just comes out of the screen there and you can see uh, your most featured uh, or most recently used music. I'm just going to quickly dive into the weather so you can see some of the um, demonstration here for the 3D effects. And it doesn't seem to want to work. We won't go into that. Okay. So now I'm going to demonstrate to you uh, the uh, pen or our HTC uh, Scribe technology. So I'm just going to dive into the notes application. And here we can create notes. We can actually associate them to a particular meeting. So let's pick, for example, you're attending Mobile World Congress. Click new note. And here we can record voice. But actually we can also record notes that we write down. So when we play this back, you'll actually see the note appear on the screen when you wrote it in real time. So it maintains the context of the note taking. You can add attachments and a picture. You can also type onto the screen here. And then this is where the pen really comes into play. So you'll see that you've got two buttons on the pen here. The top one, if I press and hold, I can actually erase the notes that I've taken. And the bottom one here, I can use to select text. So then it's much more in the capacitive stylus. Goes far beyond that. Okay. Mm -hmm. These set, these notes will then be backed up, and stored against the calendar event, but also backed up online using Evernote. So third-party application. So you will always be able to find them and um, refer to them in the future. Okay. Press that. Also, you can take snapshots of a particular screen. So, for instance, if I just tap the screen here, it will take a snap of the, of the screen there. And if I tap down here, I'm actually able to choose different pen styles. So, on here I can choose the pen size, here I can choose the style, and then here I can choose the colour. Then I can highlight areas. So, for instance, I'm on a web page, I could highlight a particular area, and then I can send that to my friends once I've finished a bit. And I can actually share that with my um, with my friends via email or Bluetooth or however I want to share. Now I want to show you quickly our watch experience. And I'll just quickly draw your attention. Here we have our buttons on the bottom uh, in portrait. If I flip it, all of a sudden they're down there. You can use them in the same way. Now watch is where you can go to download uh, high quality video content, you can stream that, you can buy it, you can rent it, it's up to you, use your credit card however you want. Uh, Brian's got it, he's in the room uh, and you can uh, download and review uh, high quality videos uh, as you wish, and stream them directly from Swatch. Just take you back home. And I just want to draw your attention to uh, OnLive. So OnLive is a, a online gaming uh, solution which we'll be offering with Flyer. And we have a video just showing you what OnLive is going to look like. But it's not going to work. So we forget that. So that's HTC Flyer with the pen experience. Um, 
going to be loads more interesting stuff coming at launch. Okay, what are the buttons around the outside? There's a power button on the top there. Power button on the top with the 3.5mm jack. We've got a volume ease on the side. And then you'll notice you've only actually got one port for charging. Um, we're also able to go uh, to HDMI out through this port here. Uh, you can charge using our proprietary charger or a micro USB. So it's a three, three solution That's in not, one. Is uh, that external USB or X, XT USB that HTC used to use quite frequently, or is it no, something it's just a new? micro USB. Oh, right. Okay. Plus, um, you can plug the HDMI directly go into the television. Okay. Are those stereo speakers as well? Yeah. In the back? Yeah. And we also offer um, Dolby Mobile and SMS virtual surround um, audio profiles for better audio experience. Does that come off? Or? Uh, no, this comes off. That bit. And in there you'll find where you can add the SIM card. Uh -huh. So this device you're able to use on 3G and Wi-Fi. You're not able to make voice calls. Okay. That's not with a gingerbread. Yeah, it comes with gingerbread. Bitdefender is dedicated to protecting people's digital lives, so working with Unboxings.com to help preview and review the latest technology is a perfect fit.